Okay. So it's happening. So much of my hair fell out that I'm not even sorry to be taking it out at this point because there's no choice. Look at this. So I guess if I was a chicken, the decision was made. Because <laughs> this is not nice, right? Shaved other people's heads before, but not my own. A little scared is it the right way to hold it? I don't know. Let me I was gonna start at the top, but I guess I start at the side. Ooh, that's coming off. Ooh, actually, this is fun. Okay, why did I wait this long? Uh, maybe somebody's gonna have to fix it if it's patchy. Oh my god, I can't believe this. Okay, maybe this is something to put on a life's to-do list. Shave your head once. Just so you know how this feels. Okay, thank you. Universe for, <laughs> I guess, making me do it? I don't know. Oh my god, this is awesome. You don't know how this feels until until we do it. When my hair first started falling out, I was crying. I didn't know I was gonna cry. When I found out cancer, I was crying, obviously. I thought I would be crying now, and I'm not crying. The suggested setting was number two, so that's what I did. They said wash your hair and then pull out as much as you can in the shower. But I didn't want to do that, so. But then they said put it at number two and then and then just take the rest of it off with a lint roller, which I thought was an interesting idea. And my son told me he wants me to do it at home so he can take the hair and try to make wool out of it. Ooh, now I have the side shave okay i guess you don't necessarily need to oops wait till you have cancer to shave your head do i ever need the hair back do i maybe not Maybe I never need hair back again because this is a lot of fun. Oh my god, this is 